Tuesday, June 9th, and good morning, everybody. Starting off the day into the mid 40s, uh, increased cloud cover. We're loading our atmosphere in for what will be rain showers. Starting off this morning, probably around 8 o'clock, 47 degrees, uh, 52 at noon, and our high today, 55, uh, well below average. Our average high this time of year is about 72. So we're going to see a continuation of the cool, wet weather that's going to uh, be with us throughout the day. Um, Western satellite and radar showing, uh, again, indeed, that uh, we're seeing that cloud cover coming. We had a clear sky at 3 a.m. with a waning full moon. It's about three quarters now. And well, we're starting to see the clouds move in, and we're going to have that rain. Now, we look at the Doppler radar closer to home. Now, again, earlier this morning, we didn't really have much at all. But it is going to fill, and we are going to see those rain showers uh, throughout the day. Highs day only into the mid-50s uh, for our area, which is, again, well below average. 66 in Moses Lake, Wenatchee, 63. Everybody is cooling down. Uh, 55 in Pullman, Lewiston. Uh, scorching 62 degrees. Now, we do warm up as this system passes over. Uh, we will have a better day on Wednesday. Should be dry, patchy morning fog, and then we'll get into partly cloudy conditions. 72, that's normal. 77 on Thursday, again with uh, some clouds. And then Friday, another round of uh, evening showers and potential thunderstorm activity uh, because we are transitioning once again to a cooler, wetter weekend and a high of 76 on Friday. But it is going to be warm uh, building into the end of the week. Overnight lows will be uh, around 50 into the mid-50s for Friday morning. Uh, that is the forecast as it stands right now. We are going to see maybe a few changes, but uh, a lot going on. We have a low up into Canada, a low that is approaching right now, and that's bringing in these showers. First Alert Weather app and your 4 News Now News app with push alerts available on your app store. They are absolutely free. And remember, with the First Alert Weather, you've got radar right in the palm of your hand. You can see where it is and when it's coming in, plus extended forecast. A lot of good information there. And again, absolutely free. I'm Mark Peterson with 4 News Now and the First Alert Weather. Hope you have a great day.